When drawing a sweep in a family, if you draw sweep by sketching the path, it's only possible to sketch the path on one work plane. For example, this is the reference level. If I draw a path in the plan view like so, and then I go to the 3D view, and I continue to draw lines for the sketch path. Because I can only draw in one plane, it will always draw the lines on the work plane defined. Therefore, how do you make a 3D sweep when there is no additional geometry to use? Well, it's simple. Here I have a very basic family with some reference planes and parameters for the width, the depth, and then in elevation, the height. So in order to create a three-dimensional sweep, what I can do is go to the Create tab and draw some reference lines along the reference planes where I wish the sweep to follow. So I will select reference plane. I'm happy that the work plane is the reference level for these reference lines, so I will simply select and create two reference lines on the edge reference planes here. Note that they automatically snap and lock to the extents of the reference planes like so. I can now go to my front elevation and I will now firstly set my work plane to be the front reference plane which I have named. Click OK and I will then draw three more reference lines, making a chain to form a goalpost. Again, checking that the reference lines lock to the reference planes. If I go into my 3D view, I can see this three-dimensional shape of reference lines. To create a sweep that follows these reference lines, I can simply go to Create Sweep, and instead of the Sketch Path tool, I will use the Pick Path tool. I will select all of the reference lines, click Finish, and I can now either edit the profile or select a preloaded profile family like this one here. You can see it's added a circular profile in like so. Click finish edit mode. And here we now have a 3D sweep. If I go to the family types, and I change the depth, for example, and click Apply, and then the height. The sweep geometry adjusts as the reference lines, as its basis, adjust with it. So that's a handy tip to create 3D sweeps.